Hello everyone, I am Harshita and today I am going to explain you about the topic recurring invoices. So what is recurring invoices? Invoices that needs to be created and paid on the regular basis are recurring invoices. For example, electricity bill, rent for this invoice need to be generated on regular basis. So by using the recurring invoice functionality available in Oracle Fusion Payables, we can create an invoice just once by linking a general purpose calendar and defining the from and to period of the calendar for which, for which the invoices are to be generated. So here is the sample example of recurring invoices. You can see that. Now I'm moving to the steps for creating a recurring invoices that are, first we need to create tables calendar in which we will give the frequency at which we need to create invoice. Second step is to create recurring invoice template in which we will, get, we will give all the details by using which we will create an invoice. And the third step is to create recurring invoice. So these are the steps which we need to follow to create a recurring invoice. Now we will go to the application and see how this is performed. After logging to the application, we will go to setup and maintenance. Then from task list, we will select manage implementation project. Now from here, we will search and select for the project which we are working. Now on the task bar, we will search for the task name as main manage payables calendar. Then click on this manage payables calendar hyperlink. Then go to task manage calendars. Now here we will select the business unit for which we need to create this manage calendars. Select and add. Apply and go to task. Now from here, select the business unit for which this payable calendar is need to be generated. So this is my business unit, US1 business unit. I'm selecting it. And just after selecting, click on save and close. Now for creating tables calendar, click on this icon to create. Now here, give a name to your calendar. Like I'm giving here, US recurring. Now description is not mandatory. Calendar type you can select as general purpose. Monthly frequency you can give weekly, other, quarterly, monthly. So I'm just selecting here monthly. It is the frequency at which we needs to create or generate our invoice. I'm selecting it as monthly. Start date is the start date of our calendar. That is I'm giving in January. 2021. Now after doing this, just click on generate periods. You can see that period has been generated. After this, just click on save and close by which your payables calendar has been created. Now we need to create an invoice template for this, we need to download a spreadsheet. And before downloading, downloading that spreadsheet, 
you must have an application development framework desktop integrator installed and run on your system so that that's uh, that spreadsheet which we are downloading can work without that application our spreadsheet will not be able to work so you can just go to the navigator and under the tools under the tools you can find that application just download that application and after that for creating in recurring invoice template we'll need to go to the navigator under navigator we will go to payables and the payables invoice then from this task list we will go to create recurring invoice click on that the spreadsheet has been downloaded just click on that so now in the spreadsheet do enable editing do you want to connect say yes now give here your login credentials now after login give your business account here just select your business account that is us1 business unit then give invoice number i'm giving here r invoice inv then give invoice amount i'm giving here 1000 then click on this double click on the supplier and select the supplier dell in corporation is our supplier search select and okay then supplier number automatically fetched but when we have given supplier the supplier number automatically fetched due to this asterisk sign which means if you give one detail other will automatically fetch by this spreadsheet now moving on to the supplier side just double click on it search for the supplier side then select okay after this give invoice currency that is usd this usd payment currency also usd then we will select the calendar that is the payable calendar which we have created in the first step just double click here search for our calendar that was us recurring search select and okay now give from period and to period this is the period for which you want to generate your recurring invoices and just double click here search by year 2021 select the period like i am selecting here july in the same manner just click on to period double click search by year search i'm selecting here as november 21 then amount we have given as 
thousand. Then give the distribution set. Just double click here. And say, for example, I'm creating this recurring invoice for the telephone expense. So I'm just going to search for that. Select and say, OK. Rest fields are not mandatory. So we are ready with the template. Now, after that, you can see under create invoices tab, generate. Just click on that. Upload option, it is saying on failure, continue to upload subsequent road, rows. Here I have created only one row. In a same manner, you can create n number of rows as per your requirement. So just say OK here. So you can see that confirmation is coming. The number of recurring invoices created is five. As we have given from to two period is July, August, September, October, November. And the monthly frequency, which we have given in the payables calendar was months, was in months. The period frequency was in months. And we have given the from period to two period is July to November. So that's why five months have been created for the recurring invoices. Now you can also see under template row status, row inserted successfully is coming. So we are done with the template. Now we will go back to the application and see that our invoices has been created or not. So going back to the application. And now in the application, go to navigator. Under navigator, go to payables. Under payables, go to invoices. Now from task list, Select manage invoices to see the invoices which we have generated. Search by supplier. Now you can see here the invoices which we have generated by using templates are visible here. It's RNV1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We have created five recurring invoices. Just click on any one of them. And you can check all the details that we have feeded are coming correctly. So this was all about the recurring invoices. Thank you.